everyone, how are we? Today we're here to talk about September's Community Day coming to Pokemon Go. So I'm really excited for this Community Day in September as it features a brand new shiny Pokemon coming to the game. So without further ado, let's talk about Grubbin Community Day in Pokemon Go. Alright, so here is the information that is up on the Pokemon Go website. As we see, September 2023 Community Day will feature Grubbin. As I mentioned, this will be a brand new shiny debuting in the game for the first time. Okay, so it says here, September 2023 Community Day Grubbin will be happening on Saturday, September 23rd from 2 to 5 p.m. local time, so of course, normal Community Day hours. Trainers were excited to announce that Grubbin, the larva Pokemon, will be featured during September Community Day. Of course, right here, it says Grubbin will appear more frequently in the wild. Pretty much the only spawns will be Grubbin, and it says if you're lucky, you might encounter a shiny one. So as with all Community Day odds, it'll be a 1 out of 25. For the featured attack, it says Evolve Charge Bug Grubbin's Evolution while near a Magnetic Lure during the event or up to 5 hours afterwards to get a Vickle Volt that knows the fast attack Volt Switch. Grubbin that evolve into Charger Bug in that period will also know Volt Switch. So it says Volt Switch here does 12 power in trainer battles and 14 power in gyms and raids. And of course, with every community day, there will be a $1 special research ticket in the shop available for purchase. It says for one US dollar or the equivalent pricing, you'll be able to access the Grubbin Community Day exclusive special research story plugging along. Stay tuned for when tickets for the special research story go live, which of course they should be going live from 2 to 5 p.m. Don't forget, you of course can now gift the tickets to friends in the game as well. So these are normal special research tickets as with every community day they'll just pretty much give you more encounters and special items. For the event bonuses we'll be seeing three times XP which is one of my favorite bonuses that we can get, two times candy for catching Pokemon, two times chance candy XL, three hour lure modules and incense, and of course you'll get a few snapshot encounters that feature Grubbin as well. You'll get one additional special trade at 50% Stardust. As with previous community days, there will of course be the bonus raids happening shortly after the community day hours. So it says here, after the three hour community day event ends, trainers will be able to take on special four star raid battles. Claiming victory in one of these raids will cause more Grubbin to appear around the gym that hosted the raid for 30 minutes. So these four star raids will have these blue eggs, almost like with these like white clouds on them. And these will be featuring Charger Bug. So once you defeat these Charger Bug raids, for 30 minutes, you will get extra Grubbin encounters around the gyms. These are great for people who won't be able to play during the community day hours from 2 to 5, but maybe will be able to play after and still get those shiny Grubbin that way. And of course, it should be noted that you cannot use remote raid passes on these. These are local raid passes only. There will also be timed research during the event, awarding one magnetic lure between 2 p.m. to 10 p.m. local time. So as noted, you will need a magnetic lure to evolve into a Vickavolt, which is Grubbin's final evolution. There will also be some field research available. So September Community Day themed field research will be available. Catch Grubbin to earn rewards such as additional encounters with Grubbin, Stardust, Ultra Balls, and more. So again, with every Community Day, it will pretty much be the same. You get extra encounters and bonus items as well. Web Store exclusive Community Day deals. Trainers can purchase the Ultimate Community Day box at an exclusive discount from the Pokemon Go web store. So as you guys know, the Pokemon Go web store, sometimes they have special offers for Pokecoins and other boxes. So check that out if you're interested. Pokestop showcases. Be on the lookout for showcases at different Pokestops during Grubbin Community Day. So with the showcases, they've pretty much all been extra, extra large so far. So I imagine you want to keep those extra, extra large Grubbin for a shot at winning those showcases. And last but not least, stickers. You'll be able to get event themed stickers by spending Pokestops, opening gifts, and purchasing them from the in-game shop. So these stickers are always really cute. They're really great to commemorate the events. And yeah, that looks like about it for Grubbin Community Day. If you guys enjoyed, please make sure to drop a like and a comment on the video. Let me know down below if you guys are excited for Grubbin Community Day or if it's already passed by the time you watch this video. Let me know how many Grubbins you got and if you got any really good ones. Make sure to also leave a subscribe on the channel if you guys are liking the Pokemon Go and Cozy content. I super appreciate all the support so far. We are really close to a thousand subs. And with that, I wish you guys the best shining luck possible. Hope you have a great community day, guys. Really go out and enjoy the weekend, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.